Welcome back to another video. So today's video, we are going to be playing Florida State Roleplay. So today's Florida State Roleplay's video, I've only played this game a couple times, but I've heard great reviews, so we're going to be going over the FD police team and civilian, so let's go. And before this video starts, I have a huge announcement. So as you guys probably all know, I've made my videos on my phone or my Xbox normally, but I will be changing content up a little bit. So of course, I'm going to be playing Roblox a lot, but I'm also getting a PC, a personal computer, so I can play different Roblox games, different games on the PC, anything. So you guys can write down comments down below what you want me to see me play. And another thing, my Discord server, I actually have two of them now. I put them both in the links uh, in the description down below. So let's get into Florida State Roleplay. Let's go. Alrighty, we are now in the game. It is completely dark. Oh, not anymore. It's clearing up. So as you can see already, it shows you the temperature and the time of day and you have your direction on the screen as well. You also have a phone and a flashlight, the phone that works and the flashlight. It's actually the same as Connecticut. But the thing is, why it is, is because I believe one of the developers is with Connecticut and they're good friends. So that might be another reason. Or they just found it. Um, the database. Don't know what that's supposed to do. You have the time in the top right and the menu. So on the menu, it shows you all of the teams. You have your rules if you want to um, pause it and look at that. You have the links and it's the link to the Discord. And you can just copy that and then put it into the search bar or whatever. You have your settings, the bloom, the fog, the shadows, and the... Um, never mind. I can't... I'm not pronouncing that. And you have your game passes, which is the uh, gun pass and the donation pass. The prices are... 100, which is not that much. A gun pass, which is 50. Oh, sorry about that. Pretty good pricing. Uh, pretty cheap, which is good for a lot of people. The spawn menu is amazing. I love how it's actually like this, so you don't have to do the little click through. And these are your donation pass vehicles as well. Is this a, is this a truck? Okay. I think that might be a new team soon for truck or whatever. So, I'm just going to go with the Evo X. I love this car so much when I used to be in Connecticut. And you also have a spawn uh, color. So, we'll go bright yellow. Just to, you know, get it good. So, the cars are scripted. Don't know why they won't be, but uh, you have this nice parking lot. You have the beach. And, oh my goodness, wait a second. Wow. Look at the water. It actually kind of moves up. That is very realistic. I love that. That's already a good rating. You also have a bunch of beach houses along this area. So remember, it is Florida. So you're going to have this a clear lobby for me as well. So it's a pretty big map looking by this. So we have a gas station over here. Oh, let me. Oh. And also they do have groups I was trying to fix the audio, it was not working. And just a nice little area, you have birds flying around. I don't think, yeah, it is moving. And you have a nice little neighborhood right here. Pretty cool, and what is this? Wait a second, we might have to explore. So, I don't think we're supposed to go in here. Let's check. Hello, what is this? Is this like, I think this is where horses are, but the horses might be dead. It might be pigs, too. Pigs, pigs, horses, elephants, giraffes. Did I just say a draft for a giraffe? Uh, what's going on with me? So you have, uh, I believe this would be the FD station. We'll go over that pretty soon. It is a nice little area. Looks like um, some more houses. What is, is there like a city area that I'm missing out on? Just like the little drive. So, let's just go on to the next team. Maybe you will be in the area. And I was playing this game a couple days ago. And uh, they do have an EMS team. But I believe uh, they're still working on it. And it'll be ready soon. So, the Florida uh, Highway Patrol uh, Troop L. So, how about that's going to be the station for police will go on. Uh, not the sheriff. So, as soon as you get into the game, you have to select your call sign. And you can see on the top left, you have all this stuff set up. You have your traffic cones, your radar gun, 
your notepad that actually works, your flashlight, and your phone, and you can pick up your vest right here. Excuse me. Man, I've had some really bad hiccups. And how do I get out of here? So here we go. So it's a pretty nice station. It's a little modern, which I really like with the glass windows. You got your flag as well. So let's look at the cars that we're working with here. So we currently have two cars and then the demon. I want to just see the demon. Oh my god, that's beautiful. I bet you can change the color as well. This game has really nice cars, and I really respect that. So we'll go over the two cars and then go on the next team. Maybe I should rank up in here too. <laughs> so the Dodge uh, 2016 Dodge uh, Charger. Oh my goodness. This looks nice. I just want to get a nicer angle. Alright. So as you can see already, it is the state trooper car and it has the Florida Highway Patrol uh, on the vehicle, the FHP, and the state trooper all over the vehicle, which is pretty nice. And the. Uh, light bar on top. I love how it's the house top like I said in the last video, I believe and here are the lights Oh Wow that This might be one of the best cars I've ever seen for a game not ever but amazing here are the lights. Please don't uh, Cyrus. Please don't be loud So all of them except for the last one were loud, and here is the last little overlay if you want to check it out. So pretty nice. I'm going to give this a 9 out of 10. One of my favorite cars already in the game. So on to the next team, which is... Oh, not team. Next car, which is the 2018 Ford Interceptor. Oh, so I thought it was a truck. It's an Explorer. What am I thinking? So for the first look, you can see it has the same design with the State Trooper. Wait. Uh, arrive. Oh, oh, it's a Florida license plate. Pretty cool. Uh, has the Florida Highway uh, Patrol. Well, kind of the same design, which is also pretty cool. And here are the lights on it. So it's the same bluish white, which I really like. And pretty nice. And here are the sirens. So pretty cool again. I really like this car again. I'm going to give this a 8 out of 10 and on to the next team, which is uh, the fire department station one. Maybe they'll have a station, uh, station two in the future. So as you can see, we have a lot and you also have your ALS jump bag in your other um, hot bar. So the BLS uh, medic pack, you have your flares, your spreader, and yep, you know what this is. I'm not going to abuse it this time like I normally do. What I have it, but I'll test it for you guys if you want me to. Yep, as you can see, it really just spreads stuff apart. But do not do this in game as it can be very annoying. Just when you do it, just don't do it very abusive. Just you use it normally. Uh, this is the cutter. I don't know why this is popping up like that. They might need to fix that. You have your small cones, your K12, your okay, turn down the volume. You have your foam and your water. You have your flashlight, and here are all your uniforms. You have, I don't know what this is. This might be EMS. Um, wait, can I switch? And these as well, your fire gear. You click on it, and you can get your helmet. Pretty cool. And then you can press confirm. Rem oh, and now I'm bald. Great. This is amazing. Never felt better. Alright. So... Wait, where was I? So now, okay, so here are the cars. I forgot. I was so brain dead. Wait, where do we go? So uh, this is EMS right here. So we'll just do the engine 32. So as you can see, it is a red, white design, which this is a beautiful car. So not car, fire truck. So you have all your compartments on here as well. The little back and on the inside. Let me... As you can see, you have all your gear that you will need on the inside. Here are the lights. So pretty nice overall. I'll give that a 8 out of 10. And just for the video so you guys know what the Medic uh, 25 looks like.
It is kind of like a uh, fire rescue, not EMS, because it is all red, and the wheel actually moves. It shows you how many people are inside, and on here, you have your little seat where you sit down while they will perform on you, and here are the lights. It is blue, white, and uh, red. So pretty cool. Again, I'm going to give that a 8 out of 10. And the final team that we'll check out is uh, the DOT team. Uh, since they're the EMS, I think they're still working on it. And maybe next video, maybe when they have an update, we could go over it. So we have our traffic cone, our small cone, our uh, road work, a head sign, our K-12, our end, end road work sign, concrete barrier, barrier, uh, barrel, uh, barrel cone, flashlight, and phone. So on the inside, kind of not that much. There's just some boxes, some crates where you deliver stuff off. Pretty cool as well. Here's where you would drive out. A uh, trucker shipment, as it says. Can we go in here? No, we cannot. Maybe in the future, future dot update they will. Uh, you have two cars and the donation pass. If you are wondering, it is a tow truck, and uh, I bet it would work. Wait, let me see. Yep, and here are your controls. So pretty cool again. That is for donation pass. Maybe I will root, uh, review them if I get them. So you have the 2020 Chevy uh, Silverado. So as you can see, it is a pinkish, orangish color with the light bar on the top and the, the stuff in the back, your barriers and your cones. It has no sirens, but it has lights, which are yellow and white. Is it moving backwards? I think it's moving backwards. So, and you also have your uniform, which is also pretty cool. You, the Ford uh, F-150 traffic enforcer. So this would to uh, this would be used. Oh my! It, oh my goodness! This is a monster, yo! So you have your road work signs, your uh, cones, and another cone stuff and this would be used uh, to tell people where to go if there is traffic and up down oh my yo what yo oh my god that's so cool i've never used one of these before so it kind of shows you where to go so let's say we have traffic over here okay wait can it work so yeah, so if there's traffic over here, it says to go over there, which is pretty cool. So I give this a 9 out of 10. So that is going to wrap it up for today's video on checking out Florida State Roleplay. I definitely recommend this game to you guys. Show the game some love because it is doing pretty well, but I want it to do amazing. Also, info on my game, it is doing pretty well. And I just want to say this. There might be another game coming for a uh, place where I am... Uh, home with which is one of my other areas where I like to be and so just saying that it's not really official but I might have two games uh, one of them is coming out probably the end of August uh, we're almost there kind of um, fixing some stuff up so I hope you guys enjoy today's video and goodbye see ya